I'm here at A Taste of Columbia doing a very special show every Sunday night. Every Sunday, we have live music here from noon until 2. That's free. But every Sunday night, live music. I said live music right here at Taste of Columbia in a little room called El Salon. This is what it looks like. That's my buddy Paul Chen. He's on sound. I am the curator of the show. My name is Michael Williams. Take a look. Lost and Profound and Gord Depp of the Spoons. Back from her holiday deep in the south, our heroine brings a cigarette to her mouth. She's burning pictures of strange foreign men. She laughs at the fire and then she laughs again. And it's a brand new set of lies that you gave to me. I was gone. I was gone. I was. Terry and Lisa, thank you so much for doing the gig. I mean, uh, it's the invitational for me. Like, you can't play it unless I invite you. I invited you guys. I had never seen you live. I love the records. And what you did live tonight, just everybody felt. It went through everyone. Thank you so much. You know, it was We're great. thrilled. Thrilled to have been able to be here, especially on the opening night of yeah. such an amazing, uh, yeah, fantastic. Well, Thank you. you know, I, I loved it because, you know, it harkens back to the to the days when there wasn't any artifact any artifice between the relate the audience and the band so it was it was that pure communication people were listening people weren't you know just on their phones drinking they were like totally there so it's nice for us to be able to do that like it's special you don't often get that you play bars you, you know you don't get to sort of have that connection with people which I, I think it's great what you're doing come on you got to say a few words about about goodbye mine what a great record Thank you. Yeah, yeah. We were really proud of it. You know, it took 10 years to make. Not really. I mean, we spent one year making it, but it took us nine years to want to make it. Yeah. Uh, and then when we did, man, it was like it felt organic. It came together. The songs were there and uh, people are reacting to it. People are buying it, which is hard to do these days. Yeah. Nobody albums anymore. So, Nobody. You know, we're out there now. We're back playing and we're having a great time doing it. And, you know, we're really proud of the album and we're really proud that we're you know, we're taking it one day at a time and we're going moving forward so there's going to be a lot of more records and a lot of more music from us. Love.